Hello, people, it's Poet, and yes, we are finally back in Jurassic Park Operation Genesis. Now, first things first, I'm going to be going through an entire playthrough of just the normal park. My words aren't even making sense, but that's what we're going to do. I'm going to go through and play through the park uh, without any mods except for the ones that we already were using, uh, which just do graphical changes. So let's go and do that. Start. You saw the shape of the island as it was making you dizzy. So this is our park. Now I got to get used to like everything again. Um, I really haven't played this since, well, since the last episode, which was like half a year ago. So let's get started. Now, a uh, few things are going to change. First things first is that I'm going to be more than likely, um, I'm going to be breaking the season, the <laughs> blah, blah, blah. I'm going to be breaking the episodes into seasons uh, because when I was talking to someone about the series and I was like, yeah, I'm on episode, you know, I could almost be on episode 100. And they were like, yeah, but you're starting it over. And, you know, it, it doesn't make sense that you're starting it over and you're on a, such a high episode number. It just doesn't make sense. And I kind of agreed with that. Um, it makes so much more sense to break it into seasons for every playthrough that we do. So for this playthrough, we're going to be uh, calling this Season 2, even though we have been through many, many, many other parks. Uh, let's do a amenity, a restroom. So I kind of have a small goal for this playthrough, just a tiny goal. And it might sound crazy, and I don't even know if it's possible. We're going to find out pretty quickly if it's possible or not. Um, and probably people will call me crazy, and they'll know right away if it's possible or not. Um, but what we're going to do, what we're going to go ahead and do, is play this as though... Um, hold on. Why, why is my mouse... My mouse is acting... Mouse, behave yourself! I can't like, I can't spin around things as fast as I used to be able to. That's, that's kind of weird. I'm not sure why I can't. I don't have to like use the zoom in keys. Like look at how, look at I'm zooming with my mouse. How slow it is. And like if I use the keys on the keyboard, how fast it should be. Why is my mouse to? Why? Anyway, I'll figure that out. But um, we are going to be trying to build a park this time without any dinosaur well no not without any dinosaurs that would be crazy without any herbivores is that a good idea or what so here we go we've got our little park uh entrance and in the park entrance we've got a kiosk and amenities bathroom we got one cleaner and a ranger station for that added security benefit uh, that people will assume that we have. I gotta get used to the keyboard controls if it's gonna be this slow. Um, but what we're gonna try to do is build a park without herbivores, so a completely carnivorous park. Um, if I look at the dinosaurs that we can get, if I put a hatchery down um let's just for fun for kicks and giggles let's put it down just right here for now i'm not gonna release a dryasaur out into the middle of the wild without a fence anymore you know that was that was our first playthrough okay Hi this time we're gonna do it right so we can see that we can get an aranosaur which isn't even full dna yet let's see it's no small herbivores we can get a tenontosaur which is another dinosaur in the mod that we're using. Um, no carnivores whatsoever. So as you can see, this is going to be a problem for us right away. Because it usually only gives you herb herbivores to put in your park. And if I'm only going to have carnivores in the park, that means that I'm going to have to make a ton of money in order to research these guys 
uh, without actually having any dinosaurs in the park. So... <laughs> this is going to be kind of crazy, I have the feeling. Uh, I'm going to put... This is so crazy. I'm going to put this right here. And then I'm going to put down uh, maybe some more kiosks. Because honestly, like, how else can we make the money, right? So, let's put down... Like, maybe... Ooh, I can't put one there. Let's put one right here. A few more kiosks. And let's go and rate them with, like, let's put Dino Dog and and Chili. And let's, let's get uh, six bucks for it. So if we can, if it costs us ten and we charge sixteen, it's going to give us six dollars back. I want to get at least six dollars per food element. Hello. I'm going to charge one dollar to use the restroom at the very least. Though people I know from a long time ago were actually suggesting to me that I charge way more for the bathroom because people oh. have to people have to pee. You can charge like up to ten dollars. Ten dollars? When you gotta go, you gotta go. Uh, I'm just gonna charge one dollar, because I don't think that people really want to come to my park as it is. So, <laughs> we don't want to drive everyone away. Uh, sandwich will cost us five dollars, and let's charge ten. That'll give us another five. Uh, if we charge twelve, that'll give us seven. Five is fine. Five is fine. Well, let's go and get a burger and fries and let's charge twenty to twenty dollars twenty dollars and then over here um it'll be another rex burger and let's go and add a salad with that and we'll charge twenty dollars there as well okay so that's basically it you guys i mean honestly we are ready to start making money if i could build Right now, I can't unlock it because I haven't researched it. Um, but if I could build things like the the uh, what are, what are they the the souvenirs? That's the word I'm trying to look for. If I could build a souvenir thing right now, I would. Um, but I have to research that. So let's see what else can I really do here? Environment, that's all fine. Attractions, I, I really. I have the one, and I'm surprised if they'd use that. Amenities. Um, really, that's about it, too. Um, okay. So, let's go through here and go to our research. And right away, let's try to research... What should we do here? Souvenir stand is kind of what I want. Um... Cash machine would also be kind of beneficial because the more money they have in their pocket, the more money I get right away. That's kind of a good thing when we're trying to get as much money as we can right away. The stuff for the dinosaurs, strangely enough, this is the first time I'm saying it, but we don't really need it right now because we don't have any dinosaurs. Right now, I'm just about ripping people off so that we can get our carnivore park going. So, this is the most expensive one, the souvenir stand, but I think it'll generate the most money back. Uh -huh. So, let's do that one first. And what else can we really do? Welcome. Let's uh, charge 500 bucks, I guess, is a good entry fee. And open it. Oh, no. What? My plot is foiled already? You must produce a dinosaur before you can open your park. You're kidding me. You're kidding me. Well, you know what? We're going to we're going to do what we said we wouldn't do. And we're just going to go here. We're going to create a uh Let's go ahead and create a uh, aranosaur. Sure. Just one aranosaur. It can be out in the wild for all I care. Um I guess we had to make it. I kind of wish that it was something a little bit less intrusive, like a dryosaur or something. Uh, because it would be tiny and it would run off and then I'd never see it again and I'd be fine with that. Um, but that's fine. Once we have our carnivores, they can go and eat this Aranosaur for all I care. Um, I think that it's just kind of a necessity to have a dinosaur, which is kind of unfortunate that we had to. 
But that is the point of the game, so I can kind of see why they do that. There it is. Okay. So, now I can open this, right? Yes. Moderately long. Time to arrival? Nobody wants... Nobody wants to come. Yay. It gives me great pleasure to declare the newest wonder of the modern world, Jurassic Park. Now open. Yeah. Look at this wonder of the modern world. Look at it. It's got four <laughs> burger joints, a bathroom, a cleaner, and that's basically it. Welcome, everybody. But it's a moderately long wait, which to me means that, you know, before we see anybody... It's going to be kind of crummy here. Uh, new shipment at the fossil market. Don't need it. Fossil teams are idle. Let's go and set them up to go here and the river. Where are we? Is this in Egypt? Yeah, this is in Egypt. So this is Spinosaur territory. Especially at the river, I'd imagine. So that would be a pretty good... Start, I think, is to get some Spinosaur DNA in the, our park. Let's do it. Let's let's go ahead. Right? Um, yeah, man, there, nobody's coming. Let's, uh... I'm almost thinking, like, maybe we should just, for now... Let's maybe set us down to, like, 300 bucks. I'd even be willing to go a little bit less. I'm not sure what we can do here to uh, kind of fix that, but I guess we'll see. How can I help? This is fine. Our Aranosaur went off somewhere. Where is he? Where Where did he... Oh, there he is. There's our, our only dinosaur at this point. Is this Aranosaur? I'm not really sure why... Uh, He's just wandering around, but that's just going to be the way that it is. Alright. I hear a helicopter. Oh, these guys all came in. Okay. Welcome. Long time off. No crowding. Long time off, time to arrival. What, people aren't happy about my park already? <laughs> is this an epic failure right from the beginning? Probably. No, I want this. No! No, 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 no. I want the cleaner station. Can't I? Can oh, here it is. Hire. And we're only going to hire the one guy. Because really, there's only the one road. So let's go ahead and just clean that one road. People get to see. Oh, look. There's a dinosaur off in the distance. It's just an Aranosaur, but we got to see it. Maybe I'll go on the viewing vent and see if there's anything there. Or not the viewing vent, the, uh, what is this called? Viewing platform. See if anybody's there. Oh, is that person? Yes, yes, we have our first purchase is a bathroom visit for $1. <laughs> wow. Well, all right. Oh, they're happy, though, that they spent a dollar in the bathroom. So there's that. Uh, moderately long wait time again, but it looks like we're we're making some money here. Where's the progress on the dinosaur dig? Because honestly, like that's that's the most important thing right now. Is oh man, that's going slow, isn't it? Can I buy a team already? Oh, that's not bad. Let's buy another team. Can we buy another one? Yeah. Usually you have to wait for stars in order to buy other teams. Um, but because of a mod that we have, we can buy the teams right away. And that will also really help us in this endeavor. Actually, now, I'm, now that I'm thinking about it, maybe you can buy teams whenever you want. You can't buy other dig sites. The dig sites are locked until you unlock them. And we can unlock those too. But I think that you could always buy dig teams anytime you wanted Let's just throw this guy here or actually um, right here okay so this will give us our first fossil DNA okay there it is like do? 
Tyrannosaur remains? Are you kidding me? Are you kidding me? We... Uh, mm. Okay, you know what? Let's go to the fossil market and see what we can get here. <laughs> uh, here we go. Baryonyx, Spinosaur, or Cacaridonosaur. Any takers? I think that the Spinosaur is really... I'm not playing favorites against the uh, the Cacaridonosaur or anything like that, but... Honestly, it will have the most star rating for our park and make people come here right away. And the sooner that we can get people to come to the park and buy things, the more carnivore DNA we can get. So, there we go. I bought some Spinosaur DNA. So, let's go ahead and extract that. And for these things, for like... The Aranosaur, I'm just going to sell it. Because we don't need no herbivores in this park. Attention. There, is a storm. there is a storm approaching the island. Uh, they got a new report. I don't really care about hearing it because you guys will just be negative. Oh, people don't have... I just realized people don't have uh, umbrellas yet. So that's going to be an issue, probably. Maybe. <laughs> in progress. Oh, new people are arriving in the park. That's good. That's a good thing. Good to see you again. I wish I could see... Well, I guess I could in my reports how many people are buying things. Can I? Structure summary, finance summary, you seem to be admissions. So that's how much I've gained in... Admissions? How much I've gained from fossils, maybe? Uh, facilities. Is that like the bathroom has charged people seventy-six dollars already? Is that a, is that the truth? That's funny. I've made nothing but profit, except I've spent a lot. Well, whatever. What well, whatever works works. Uh, okay. They found nothing. What? How could you find nothing? I thought you might like some input here. Spinosaur is at 29%. Ooh, we're getting there. I'd like your thoughts we're getting there. Uh, let's go to... Anything else in the fossil market right now? Baryonyx, Cacaridonosaur. We could buy Cacaridonosaur. Its DNA is only at 18%. Um, hmm. Hmm. We could get that too, just get that started anyway. Maybe. It's a big expense, but let's let's do it. Just what I was gonna suggest. That's what you were gonna suggest? Okay. And go to the genetics lab and extract that one. Might as well keep them busy. How's our research coming along, by the way? Things are good. Things are good? Everybody's getting rained on, and things are good. Um, I would like umbrellas for the visitors. They do pay for umbrellas, right? Don't they? I wish they did. Um, people are not too happy about this rain. Otherwise, I think they're pretty happy. Like, they're pretty happy to use, to get, like, a burger and stuff. And they're pretty happy when they come out of the bathroom. So... Oh, the rain's stopping. Finally, yes. Great. Ooh. They found amber. Low from the Cretaceous. It could be anything, really. Ooh! Another Cacardonosaur piece of DNA. That'll actually really help us. Um, should I extract the, f the amber? I think... Yes, I should. Um, because it could be... Uh-oh. Cash machine, coming. And now we can get a souvenir stand, so let's build one. It's hilarious, but let's do it. Why is the dramatic music still playing? Like, the rain stopped, guys. You can stop this dramatic music now. 
Let's get them a a Jurassic Park balloon. No, let's charge them. Let's get the dino toy. And like uh, a, a, just a mm, a keychain maybe. And we'll charge them like 50 bucks. There we go. Enjoy your dino toys. Enjoy spending a ton of money on a little toy person. Great. Hope you enjoyed the lack of dinosaurs. I really did. Alright, it's been a few months now, I think, in the game. Uh, it's been raining like crazy, but everybody's got a little umbrella, so I think they're all okay. And we are now ready, finally... What are your instructions? Ooh, good. We are now ready, finally, to get some dinosaurs in the park. Real carnivorous dinosaurs in the park but first we got to build them an enclosure so let's go ahead and do that uh, we're gonna have to settle for a low security fence at this point because we haven't researched any bigger fences but let's go and do that let's go and make it a huge enclosure why not okay nice big enclosure for whatever it is that we're gonna make so we can make no small carnivores, but we can make a Spinosaur, Baryonyx, and in a second here, a second here, we're going to have Kakardonosaur as well, because it has two DNA extractions going, and Baryonyx is still going, but it's going to have two DNA extractions, and it's at 34%, so we're going to be able to have a Kakardonosaur as well. But uh, I think what we're going to try to do, it might be a bad idea with low security fence. We're going to throw in a Spinosaur and just hope for the best. Sound great? Okay. Great. So now, we got to hurry uh, to get this place fixed up. We're going to put in some... Oops, wrong menu. We're going to put in some uh, water so we can... He is a, a river creature anyway. We're going to put in a feeder, a uh, dinosaur feeder, and we're going to set that to cows. Yep, that's good. And then, really, that's that's all that we really need to do. I'm going to put in some environment, though, just so that he enjoys it. They don't need to be paleo trees. What am I thinking? Oh boy, I I'm scared actually for the fence here, but okay, that's going good. Research team, let's get some vaccines going too. I think, or should we do the be better fences? Let's get fences in, because that's what I'm scared about. Okay, so here you go, guys. We are back officially with our Spinosaur. Who's glitching out and making the camera shake like crazy. But we've got our Spinosaur back in the park. Yes. Amazing. Our carnivore park is coming along nicely. And with that, I'm going to end the episode there. Thank you guys for watching. We're back. Jurassic Park Operation Genesis. Bye-bye.